Hey guys, today we're going to be checking out On Her Majesty's Secret Service from 1969. I am super excited to check out a brand new Bond. I know it's going to be different. I feel like I'm probably going to like it. Let's get right into it. Here we go. On Her Majesty's Secret Service. So British. We got a new Bond. I've been told this one has a very different vibe. It's maybe even closer to the books, but it's a lot different than the previous one. Still have the theme. Okay, well, feels like a Bond movie to me. Miniaturization. Radioactive lit. Radioactive lit. What we want is location fix on 007. Is he lost? You check with communication. Money penny. Money penny in the head. Oh, I'm really excited to see. It is going to be weird to not see Sean Connery, though. I don't even know what he looks like. Got a little chin dimple. It feels Bondy to me. I don't know. Show me his face. I really want to see. Woo! Is it a sexy lady? Oh, very lovely. She's going to go into the ocean in that dress. Is she all right? Going to save her? Show me his face, he's in shadow. He's quite heroic so far. No, let me be. Beautiful lady, whatever is the matter? My name's Bond, James Bond. Okay. Don't move. <gasps> oh, I thought maybe it was a trap and she lured him, cause that's typical. Oh, well I kinda dig his wet t-shirt situation. I like him, I like him already. Now who are you bad guy? He's wearing gloves. Plunked him. Waterfly! Go, Bond! He's gonna have to beat him just in fighting skill. I don't think he has any water gadgets. Is that guy gonna pick up that anchor thing? Oh, it's around him. I knew it. Somebody's going for that thing. Oh. Get him! She's making a break for it. Is she taking his car? Okay, she's going back to her own car. That's not the last we've seen of her. This never happened to the other fella. Now do we get a theme song? Bond in a wet t-shirt, I mean... Yeah, so far so good. Red cougar outside. Contessa oh. Teresa de Vicenzo. She's there. There's a bed outside. I wonder how many Bond ladies he'll have in this one. Bond in a tux. Okay, I could buy this as Bond. Yeah. I should learn to play this so I understand these scenes better. Now, is he just here for the cards or is he here to schmooze someone never just about the cards that's cool those things oh i do have these these thingies banco banco it's our girl can't take his eyes off i don't have the money madame i've forgotten we agreed to be part of saved her saved her face Tom Perignon, classic. Damn it, I forgot the champagne again. People want to stay alive, play it safe. She doesn't want to stay alive. I hope it'll be worth it. Oh, definitely. But is she gonna turn out to be like a like a shady character like all the other girls? <gasps> oh God, why did that scare me so much? <sighs> I but did Tracy know that and lure him there? I mean, the old Bond would sleep with her anyway, regardless. Oh, just a spot of caviar. Mm, royal beluga. Uh, mm, delicious. Well, that's just not a British accent at all. That is a ruffly shirt. Is she messing with him? You're full of surprises, Contessa. <laughs> Who's that oh. man in your room? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't believe her. Get dressed. He's not going to sleep with her? Bond, you've changed. What else do you know? A little about women. A little. Look, you don't know me a thing. I think you're in some sort of trouble. Hmm. Here we go. That's a little more typical, Bond. <laughs> All right. Countess de Vicenzo has left the hotel. Checked out? A few minutes ago. Bond's used to be the one that checks out first, if you know what I mean. Did she take his gun? Paid in full. Interesting. I thought she didn't have any money. Hmm. Mr. Bond? Yeah. Oh. I wonder who the villain is in this one. I don't know if it's number one. I just know that he'll be back at some point. And I wonder if there's a lair. All right, where are we? Is it a villain's lair? Show me a villain. Where are we? What are all these knobs? Yeah. Get him. <laughs> the sound. Hello. 
If you wish, I'll give you another Got chance. Got to be the villain. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A martini for our guest. Shaken, not stirred. Ah, finally. Head of one of the biggest crime syndicates. The biggest. <laughs> Get it right. Construction, electrical supplies. I'm also Teresa's father. <gasps> oh, does he know they slept together? She committed some greater folly to spite me. Like what? I've been informed of everything. Everything? Don't worry. What she <laughs> needs is a man to dominate her. Oh god. I see. A man like you. Okay. This is weird for her dad to say that. That's really weird. On the day you marry her, I'll give you one million pounds. Is he gonna oh. do it? <laughs> but I don't need a million pounds. Stop it. What is Bond's money situation? He travels the world and does whatever he wants, but I don't know if he has any actual money himself. Where is Ernst Stavro Blofeld? I wouldn't tell Her Majesty's Secret Service. I might. Oh. My future son-in-law. Next so week weird. is my birthday. Let's say I'll sleep on the idea. Jay, hey, hat on. Oh, All right, let's see this chemistry. <laughs> Cocktails at my place, just the two of us. No way. You'd better go in. He's running Damn. a very tight ship. I just really want them to fall in love. Maybe someday. All right, is he going to get an assignment besides marrying a girl because she's crazy for money? I'm relieving you from Operation Bedlam, 007. Fired. Fired. That's all. <sighs> this never would have happened to Sean. Although Sean did let him get away in the last one. Take a memo, please, Money Penny. You He's serious. Accept my resignation. Resignation from what? Her Majesty's Secret Service. I never thought I'd see the day. He's not going to let him quit. There's no way. Request granted. Oh, so cold, too. This is shocking. Two weeks leave. You didn't oh. really want to resign. What will I do without you? Money, Penny. It's a date. The moment I get back. Oh, my God. Please go on a date. Kissed. Money, Penny. This girl is quite lovely, but Money, Penny is the true love here. James, you're not quitting. I will not give you a resignation. Don't worry. May I introduce my daughter? Uh. She's so cold. No woman would waste this excellent champagne. Clink. Unless, of course, she happened to be part of the arrangement. Yeah. Tell him what he wants to know, or you'll never see me again. What, it, what is it? What, what? Tell me. Maybe a connection between that man Blofeld and the lawyer, Bern, Switzerland. Mm. Named Gumball. Mr. Barton, Gumball. you'd have no further interest in me. Another mistake. Well, they're gonna end up together, but I don't know. Like, it's never permanent for Bond. I was always taught that mistakes should be remedied. She's very upset. All lovers. Look out. Okay, so now they're falling in love, falling in love montage. Oh no, that probably means she's gonna die. Mm. Picking out a wedding ring? All right, so what, they're in love now? Are we seeing Bond fall in love? Kind of had to be Lazenby then. I don't know if I'd buy Sean Connery falling in love. Gumbold. Stop right there, Gumbold. Oh yeah, he knows what he's doing. Is that a safe? <gasps> I'm gonna need him to crack that safe. He's waiting for something. Is he gonna do like a switcheroo? What do we got? What are we doing? Is it gadgets? Oh, what is this? <gasps> it's a safe cracking thing. Oh, cool. Cool, 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 cool. And now we wait. Safe cracking is so boring. Just reading the paper. <laughs> Oh, reading a Playboy, even better. Oh, beauty, what's in it? Where are the stacks of cash? All right, information. It's even more valuable than money sometimes. Well, then you get a cell phone. You could snap a photo of it. What, like a fax machine? Yep, yep, yep. He's coming back. Uh, crap. Go, 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 go. <laughs> he took the Playboy. <laughs> okay. That was smooth. All right. Very smooth. In and out. Took the Playboy. Whoa. Came across a letter from a Gabruda Gumbold, Count Balthazar de Blosham. Here we go. This is a copy of a letter request that they undertake to establish de Blosham's claim to the title. Sable Basilist of the college, suggesting that he should meet de Blosham. I can Ooh. act as a representative of the college. He thought of everything. Ah, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Sir Hillary. I'm only able on your assurance that the matter is of national importance. My department appreciates your hope. Definitely. The Blochons are without earlobes. No earlobes. You might try inviting him to Augsburg. So if he is our man, I'd like to get him away from Switzerland. All right, we're in the Alps. 
Third Hilary Bray Baronet, personal secretary to the Count. To the Count. Fräulein Bund. Bund. You will not be disappointed. A sleigh. Cool. That's like cool. Like the bugs in the rug, yes? Cozy. Like a bugs in a rugs. Snug. Snug as a bug. Now we will have a little flight. She's funny. Mind your head. Now up into the Alps. Up into the Alps. Last time he was in a plane with a lady, she dove out and left him to die. So let's hope that doesn't happen. Very beautiful view to share with Fräulein Bunt. Avalanche damage. Yikes. Are we going to see an avalanche in this? That would be cool. It is strictly private. No one without permission from the car. But we have permission. Allergy research. Allergy research. Allergy research. Get my feet on the ground. Not ground ice. <gasps> Not ground ice. Does this work for the sake of mankind? To leave ah, his what a good man. By blowing it up. Grunter takes a hero. Grunter. No. She's gonna do some shady now. <gasps> Provide him with the usual comforts. Yeah. Then take yeah. him to number it's four. number yeah. one. If you wish anything <laughs> for your comfort, and the attendant will come. Also, to open the door, a great deal to discuss. He will send for you. And he's ready. Sounds like you are a prisoner. Whoa. I feel like there will be a new sexy lady here. Oh, it's just a room filled with sexy ladies. Of course. <laughs> come to meet our patients. He's a famous genealogist. Ooh la la. But whichever babe will he choose? But what is the genealogist? Will nobody tell? It's all about ancestors and families. Now, if you will tell me your we name. We do not use surnames here. <laughs> She's such a buzzkill. We do not use surnames. It would be really hard to flirt with her around, I think. I used to hate you, Jim. This would make me break up. We'd be surprised where. No medical <laughs> stories. Hilary, <laughs> please tell us. Is she suspicious of him, I wonder? I think they know it's not really Sir Hilary. There's a picture of my own coat of arms, which includes four of them. If you care to see it. I'd love to. Oh, he's chosen no, his girl. No. Oh, he will give the book to me. <laughs> it is fair, like say. Mm -hmm. A little hanky-panky under. Is she writing her room in lipstick on his inner thigh? That girl's smooth. The Count will see you now. Grunta will take me. Yes. Follow Grunta. Whoa, this looks like a lair. <gasps> yeah, 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 yeah. Seems to be inside a mountain. Yes, yes, yes. <gasps> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, yeah. Thank you, Gronta. Balthazar, Count de Blochamp. That's what Blow I have to find out. Uh, I was born without earlobe. Blochamp, uh. ancestry. Mm, granted. Interesting. Doesn't necessarily make you the reigning count. I was a little puzzled by your remarkable clinic. I've devised a cure for allergies, holding an unusual psychological balance. Cure is like not what? entirely psychological. There are special vaccines to suit each individual case. Hmm. You may proceed with your preliminary research. But is Bond gonna, like, try and kill him? Thank you, uh, Like, he's playing along here. To what end? Oh, room eight. I forgot. Most importantly, get back to the room. Get in bed with the lady. Is he just here for Hanky Panky? Well, yes. But is there more to this girl or no? Sir Henry! No, don't tell it all. Shh. Twice as lovely in the firelight. Pretending not to like girls. Well, I don't usually. You're not usual. Call me Hilly. Hilly! <laughs> it's true! <laughs> so even though he's in love, we got another Bond girl. Oh, bother! It's part of the cure. This is weird. Are they like doing like hypnosis you know brainwashing? Baby. I must teach you how to give them special care. Yeah, this is hella creepy. There's no way he's just doing allergy research because he's a good guy. Who's this? Another girl. Perhaps if we turn on the light. No. You look lovely in the firelight. Twice as lovely. In the oh firelight. my god. I think you do not you like ass. Me? Usually I don't. But you're not, but you're not usual. usual. Wow. Is he gonna sleep with all of these women? Morning. Wow, I, I saw the first girl coming, but not the second one with the exact same lines. Found so many ladies. <laughs> Sir Hillary! Good morning. Yeah, which girl is he is he gonna show interest in? Yeah, I must see. Eight o'clock. So many babes. Nine o'clock. Eight and then nine. Bro, pace yourself. Is he here to kill the villain or just to sleep with all the girls? It's me. Maybe she's Hilly. dead. That old cow told you. <gasps> it's Bunt. Bunt, that's what happens when you let your penis do the thinking. Merry Christmas, 007. 
does know it's him. Baroness do not seduce. That's so true. See, he gave himself away because he was too busy trying to nail all the women. The United Nations will receive a Yuletide greeting. Made like a ransom? Or to destroy the economy. How? I want to hear his evil, evil plan. I prepared a demonstration of foot and mouth disease in England last summer. Well, I shall instruct them exactly how I arrange it. Oh. Bacteriological warfare. Bacteriological warfare. Total infertility. The destruction uh -huh. of a whole strain. If what? my demands are not met, the extinction of whole species of cereals and livestock, including, I suppose, uh -huh. the human race. Wow. I have been training my own angels of death. Those girls. Oh. A little therapy to soothe. He's a very cool, calm villain. Oh. Can you just get out there? Surely they would have thought of this. It is more fun to open them all together, yes. <laughs> so beautiful, so deadly. Is he gonna get out this hole or not? Why would they put him in there? They would have to know he would go out this hole. Or maybe they were counting on it. Get on top of it. Okay. Good. And after you've done what I teach you, forget it. I have chills. This guy's voice. Endeavor. What is this? Like weapon? The will never touch until I tell you how. Oh, the biological weapon. Bacteriological weapon. Not even gonna clunk anyone and take their outfit. Clunk him. Take his outfit. Oh yeah. Get him. Now switch clothes. I don't know why I want him to switch outfits so bad, but it just seems like the right thing to do. Yeah, in a hurry. Vamos your caboose, ladies. Goodbye, ladies. I never got to have a second round. You should have been gift wrapped. Ah, oh, there we go. That's a bond line. Oh my god. Please ski down the mountain. Yes. Is it gonna be like a green screen? <laughs> I love it. Ksh, ksh. Okay, we got a ski chase. Nice. <laughs> oh no! Is he gonna go down on one ski? The first snowboarder. Idiot. That's the longest fall I've ever seen. Oh, choke him with your ski. Throw him off, throw him off. I want to see another fall. Oh, what the heck is she doing there? Have you got a car? Yes, I do. He's gonna tell her that he slept with at least two other women. Nearest post office to contact London. Nearest post office. The frown line! I we better have a car chase in the Alps. Oh, yeah. Shoot at them! Shoot at them, you fool! She's a good getaway driver. <laughs> Music on point. Left, that crowd might discourage them. I <laughs> just rip right through there. Oh, where are we now? Looks like we've hit the rush out. <laughs> How do we get out? Just exit the race. Oh my. Oh! Finally, something explodes. Yeah! Oh, snowstorm. Let's take refuge in a barn. Oh, how lovely. I love you. Wow! I mean, he slept with someone yesterday, but okay. Will you marry me? Will you marry me? All right. The proper time for this is our wedding night. That's my New Year's resolution. He wants to wait? Good night, Tracy. What? <laughs> he has changed in the last tw 24 hours, I guess. Why? 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 Oh. Oh, okay. 
I was really kind of like, what is happening? Who, who is this? All right. Oh, I need to see number one. Is he wearing a hat that also looks like a bald head? <laughs> Why wouldn't he just wear a different colored hat? <laughs> He had lots of guts. <laughs> I can't believe that guy got chopped up and sprayed all over the mountain and then he said he had lots of guts. Oh my god. All right, that's classic Bond. That's classic Bond right there. <laughs> Avalanche, I knew it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, bye. Is she gonna die? No. I am going to lose it if she dies. James Bond finally opens up. He told a woman he loved her. She can't die. No, 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 no. <gasps> He's not married in the other ones. Oh, okay, well, phew. I was losing my mind there. All right. What, he just went back home? He didn't go try to save her? What the hell, man? They're going to buy Blofeld off. He's not happy about that. All task crimes. The girl who helped me escape, we just leave. Operation Bedlam is dead. These guys are not on good terms in this movie. Oh, Draco, I'd like to interest you in a demolition deal. So he's flying back up there? It is a time for celebration. Okay. Unidentified aircraft. There is something on the radio you should hear. It's an unidentified flying object. Leading Red Cross helicopter. We have no record of your flight plans. She, know it's her, she knows it's her dad, right? Tell me more. What happened to Fraulein Bunt? Did she die in the avalanche? Helicopters, we've been attacked in our positions. Oh! Ha! Yeah, blow it all to hell. But save the girl first. Oh, I do hope they blow it up. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Clunk him with champagne. Ooh! Don't mess with her. Bum ba da bum 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 ba da bum 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 bum. This is awesome. Thank God, Teresa. Get the circuit set up now. <gasps> Circuits, we're gonna blow it all to hell. Yeah, 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 yeah. A secret map. Oh, look out. <laughs> oh, God, we're laying all the charges. Oh, God. Five minutes and ten seconds. We have five minutes. I will not go without you! You'll have to! Three, two, two one. one. But Jane, is it gonna blow? Yeah! Yeah! Okay, that was good. Bob sled for real. Oh man. But is he gonna kill him or will he get away? That's my main question. Does he have a. He has a grenade. Oh shoot! Dude! That's right. Aha. Oh, his head. Oh, God. He's branched off. Did he die? Is he hanging? Now dismount gracefully, man. Oh, well, or there's that. A dog! Oh, like a St. Bernard. Get the brandy, huh? Wow, okay. Did he die, though? I don't know if number one died. It kind of seemed like he got choked in a tree branch. He branched off there. But you never know, he could return. Mr. and Mrs. James Bond. It's his wedding for real? Oh, money penny. It should have been her. This time I've got the gadgets. I know how to use them. I don't think he used any gadgets, but I think he's talking about his, you know. For the first and last time, remember? A uh, price is far above ruby. Oh, he doesn't even want the money. Okay. That makes me like him more. Come on. On your way. The looks between them. She understands him in a way no other woman will. Beautiful wedding, though. Well, now what? Three girls, three boys. Oh, wow. Well, we have all the time in the world. <gasps> Blowfell. Is she dead? Is she dead? Shut up. On their wedding day? James Bond is never going to love again like this. He'll never get married. We'll be going on soon. Oh my god, he's heartbroken. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, James Bond gets married and they drive away and she gets shot in the face. He's crying. Why? 
What? That's some bullshit. I'm not even gonna dance to this theme song. I can't believe they killed her in like the last 30 seconds. And he cried and that's how it ends. What? This is a different James Bond. Ugh. Okay guys, well that was On Her Majesty's Secret Service and I took a few minutes to calm down because I was fired up about that ending. I still, I st I'm still fired up, but that ending. In terms of this movie compared to the previous five with Sean Connery, I, I will say like I wasn't as into it as I was the other five. However, that ending really kind of blew me away. Sort of knocked it up a notch. That was like a, an edgy ending and I really, like I, I hated it. I was really angry, but the fact that it, it really got so much out of me, like I felt that ending and I'm sitting here thinking that's a really strong ending. That's a much stronger ending than just like floating in a life raft, kissing whoever. Really sold me on, on this whole movie. I think. I like this movie, but it, it, it is hard to switch to a new Bond. It just is hard. I thought he was good though. I mean, it's super hard to step into Sean Connery's shoes, I'm sure. So, but you know, he had he had charm in his own way and I felt, I felt the bondiness of him. I did. He was different though. Like at one point he even looked scared. Like Connery Bond never looked scared. He never ever showed that kind of emotion. I feel like he could have grown in the role if they had let him. I, I, that, I'm, that ended Ending, man. Woo. That's an ending. Very good. I mean, I guess it makes sense. We, he's not married in any of the other ones. Yeah, I guess she kind of had to die, but I just didn't see it coming like in that way. Literally right after their wedding, they drive away a few minutes later and she's just murdered and he just holds her and cries and that's the end. Like, that's, that's an ending. That one really hit me. MVP, I am just gonna give it to George Lazenby. I don't know that anyone could have really had a lot of success trying to follow Sean Connery. So valiant effort, I'm gonna give him the MVP. Loki MVP, I'm just gonna give it to his dead wife. She was kind of cool though. She sort of held her own with Bond. Like she wasn't just another Bond girl, you know? Like he married her, he fell in love with her. She was different, I think. She matched him. So for breaking through the tough exterior and getting the world's most famous bachelor to marry you, Tracy, you are the low-key MVP. And the worst award, we're just gonna give it to the friggin' Fraulein Bunt and Blowfield number one, at the end specifically driving by and doing a drive-by shooting of a man and woman on their wedding day. That is dirty. So you guys are the worst. Overall, this one is really interesting. I'm really glad that I saw it and I'm really glad that I'm going in order and watching them in release order as they came out. Uh, definitely let me know if you guys want me to keep going. I would love to keep going. I want to see what's next. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I had a great time. I hope you had a great time too and I will see you next time. Bye guys.